In this video, we'll talk about keeping your eyes on the ball. It's fantastic to discover yourself, have specific targets, and be motivated to see your dreams come to pass. Still, it is also crucial that you keep moving in the right direction. As a human being, you're prone to distractions, yet you need to do your best to ensure that you keep your eyes on the ball. The hacks in this chapter will be beneficial to you in this regard. Don't overrate yourself. You are a human being, and you should never forget that. Do you know anyone that used to be full of life and focus that messed up? You shouldn't laugh at such people. Instead, their fall should be a lesson to you. It should make you realize that it is possible to drop the ball in the midst of distractions and challenging situations. Don't say what happened to that person can never happen to you. You should have a realistic evaluation of yourself to keep your feet on the ground. When you admit that you can make mistakes, it will help you to keep your focus and stay away from distractions as much as possible. Even Superman is allergic to kryptonite. So don't have a delusion that you cannot lose touch with reality and ruin everything you have worked hard to achieve. If it has happened to someone else, it can happen to you. Always remind yourself that you are not impeccable. The moment you lose sight of that reality, you're already singing your swan song. It'll not take long before an event reminds you of the need to keep your focus. Don't change what works. It's a good attribute when you're open to new experiences and trying something new. Still, you cannot afford to be living your life based on a trial and error approach. You'll be wasting time and energy that way. Besides, you might hurt yourself along the line. Therefore, it's best to stick to an approach that has been yielding results. Don't be intimidated by the success of others who are doing things in a way that is different from yours. It's not every formula and technique that works for others that will work for you. For example, if you discover that the evening is your peak energy period, then that should be the period you should do most of the tedious work you have. If you have more clarity and engagement during that time, take advantage of it and do the works that require your utmost attention. Don't start doing things in the morning because some people feel that your style is weird. As long as it's working for you, stick with it and neglect the words of every critic. Stay true to yourself. One of the best things that can happen to you is to discover yourself. Discovering yourself implies that you'll have a good grasp of your strengths and weaknesses. It also means that you know the kind of things that suits you. Once you know who you are, stay true to yourself and keep heading in the right direction. There will always be tantalizing new trends that will attract you. Your friends and families will also suggest things that you can do. However, it's critical that you don't lose yourself to please others. You are a human being, so you will make mistakes once in a while. Still, it's better to make mistakes while staying true to yourself than get the right results by pretending that you are who you are not. Remember that every drama and acting will elapse. Don't allow the pressure to meet up with social standards make you start doing things you will regret. Besides, you can only feel comfortable and be at your best when you do things in the ways that suit you as an individual. Once you lose yourself, you have lost it all. Avoid social comparison. Social comparison is one of the major reasons people struggle to live life with clarity. You'll always struggle to find your true north when you have a culture of comparing yourself with other people. It's good to have mentors and people that you are looking forward to emulating. Yet the fact that these individuals achieve their success by following a particular footprint doesn't mean that you will achieve it in the same way. Your uniqueness has to shine through while following a guideline to make the most of your abilities. Moreover, it's not healthy to compare yourself with others. There will always be people that seem to be more successful than you in this world. Don't envy anyone because it will make you look down on yourself. You'll keep asking yourself, is this all I can do with my life? No one should give you a benchmark for success. You should put pressure on yourself to be the best version of yourself. Still, you need to learn to celebrate every progress you make while striving for more. Don't feel that something is wrong with your life because you are yet to hit a particular target. Keep track of your motives. The reason you are doing something is more important than the fact that you are doing it. It is your motive that will determine whether you will be satisfied or regret in the long run. For example, you might decide to start a healthy eating plan, an exercise routine to lose weight. Naturally, this is a commendable desire. Still, your motive can ruin how you'll feel about achieving your aim. If you are doing it to get the acceptance and approval of others, you might be disappointed in the long run. The people might praise you initially. However, you might soon discover to your disappointment that it takes more than a great shape to be and stay in the good books of the people around you. The fact that you have an attractive shape doesn't guarantee that your spouse will not cheat on you. It also doesn't mean that people around you will respect you. So ensure that you carry out your goals with the desire to improve the quality of your life. Any other reason is likely to end in regret. 
Keep the right company. No matter who you are and your approach to life, the kind of people that surround you can make or mar you. If you have the wrong people around you, they will always find fault with you and give you reasons to feel that you are not doing enough. They might put unnecessary pressure on you and make you start living a fake life. Everyone cannot be your friend. You should be able to keep a lid on how people come into your life. The fact that a person is your colleague at work doesn't mean that he or she should be able to tell you anything. In the same way, the fact that an individual lives on your street doesn't mean that you should have a cordial relationship. Ensure that your friends are people that share the same value as you. Don't be afraid to rock a boat and leave a relationship that is affecting you negatively. If you want to keep a clear view of life and stay true to yourself, avoid hanging around the wrong people. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.